Long multiplication with decimals is identical to long multiplication with regular numbers, except for one important difference, the position of the decimal point. When you write the numbers, ignore the decimal point. You can even delete it to avoid confusion. This also means that unlike long addition and subtraction, you do not need to align the numbers according to the decimal point. The numbers should simply be aligned to the right. Then, perform the multiplication as if you would multiply natural numbers. The important difference, as mentioned, is the repositioning of the decimal point. The number of decimal digits is equal to the sum of decimal digits of the numbers that were multiplied. Add zeros to the left if the calculated number of decimal digits is greater than the number of digits of the, pro of the product. For example, 1.65 times 0 0.25. Align the, number to the numbers to the right. Then remove the decimal points. The 0 in the point 0.25 can be ignored. Here is the complete solution. Now, count the number of decimal digits of the multipliers. There are four in total. One, two, three, four. Count four places from the right and add a decimal point there. So we go one, two, three, four. Below, three black dots represent the first three steps, and in the fourth step, you'll find the red decimal point. That is its correct position. Add a zero to the left, and you have the solution.